I started to continue the works of my brother, which would clarify me keeping up the works of Master Farad Muhammad. Not that uh, this work that my brother is doing is on his part. No, but it's on the man's part who gave it to him, and that man was God himself. That's right, sir. So I declared to the both that I would be with them until I am dead. So that makes my word to be bond. That's right. I don't care what happened. All of you that is here right now can walk out. Listen, come on. I don't care. Teach and me. I do care. But all of you can turn your back on me and say, I'm going. You ain't got nobody here. You by yourself, got enemies out in the streets against you. Well, what am I going to say? Because that you walked away, I'm going to run and hug you. Come on, brothers and sisters, stay here. Uh-uh. Remember, Master Farad said to me, I am with you. That's right. And the book Bible teaches you that if I am with you, saying of the gods, who can be against you? That's right. That's right. It doesn't make a difference if you leave. No. I'll stand right here and I get better ones coming in. That's right. That's right. That's right. Tell the truth. We have on our record here more than 2,000 membership here. See 2,000 here? And the day Savior's day? No. We don't care nothing about you, John. No. Your assistant minister say you's a prophet. I didn't say nothing about I was a prophet. He asked me, was I a prophet? I said, no. That's right. But it's that name that he was talking about. Yes, sir. When he began to push me with my name, I said, that's what my name means, that I'm a prophet. That's right, sir. Teach me. I'm not a prophet. My name means that. <laughs> a prophet prophesies things, right? That's right. Oh, yeah. Since I'm not a prophet, I can be your prophet until your prophet comes. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Make a plan. You and me never had a prophet. We never had somebody to bring us the truth. Every time we go someplace thinking somebody going to bring us the truth, they brought us lies. That's right. We had great men. I can't continue on with Master Farad because it, you know, it, it, it takes a long time. I was with him a long time, brothers and sisters. You would have to come back, 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 back again for me to tell you many of the things that he taught me 
and uh, my brother taught me the rest of it. My brother has been teaching me ever since the day that he mounted the rostrum to be the messenger for Allah. He taught me until the, I would say until the week of his death. When I visited him the last time in Chicago and he was uh, at home, when he went back to the hospital, there he passed away in death. Now I can say, Mr. Minister Firecon, I know you was thinking. That is one of the causes That is one of the causes between me and Minister Farrakhan. People have asked me a lot of times. That's one of the causes. He and Brother Jabril Muhammad and Phoenix say he is a live living. I say no. He is dead. Right, right. I have nothing against Minister Farrakhan, even if he do say that he's alive. I ain't got nothing to hate him for. That's what I'm going to hate him for. That's his knowledge. That's right? That's right. My knowledge is he dead. Right. And nobody yet has attacked me but one man, and that was Jabril. You know him, Jabril Muhammad in Phoenix. That's the oldest man attacked me with about 35 questions, and I answered a few of them and forgot the rest. That's right. Now let me show you something, brothers and sisters. You might believe that he's still alive. Let me show you something. Go ahead. Teach me. Remember, that's my brother, right? Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. And he got a son named W.D. Muhammad, right? That's right. And W.D. Muhammad told Tony, what? Tony Brown, right. I think that's his name, everything that he thought he could say against his dad. That's right. I have a book on it. That's you right. probably seen it. Right? That's right? That's right. You might believe in WD. I ain't got nothing to do with WD. I don't hate him. What I hate is the two things that they are doing. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. That's what yes, I hate. That's right. I love the man. Both of them, my nephew and Minister Firecon, I love all of them. Even to uh, Minister Silas, who was never in a minister's class. He has visited me here in Detroit. That's right. He honors me as Supreme Minister. That's right. He does. I honored him as prophet when I first met him in California. Los Angeles, me and your husband were there. You was there, wasn't you? Right. I said, Prophet Silas Muhammad, and he said, no, 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 don't say that. I said, I'll call you about what you said you are. So now it's just, I'm Silas Muhammad. That's right. Don't make no difference to me. If he say he's a prophet, you can say you's a prophet. Don't make no difference to me. No. Allah reveals to whom he pleased, right? That's right, right. But he leaves out a whole lot of these people. <laughs> Go ahead, Supreme. <laughs> you have to excuse me again. You know, you, uh, 
I want to tell you something. You tired? No, sir. I haven't got started. <laughs> don't get tired with me. I don't get tired with you. The, be the more I talk to you, the better I feel. Yes, sir. Yes. That's the way I am. <laughs> well, I better get on my subject. But here is what. Let me stop and get get over, get over this part that I came to try to talk to you about, so that you would have some knowledge of these things. But I'm giving you good knowledge as it is. Yes, sir. That's right. That's right. Now, don't you know as I was going to say? If Messenger Elijah Muhammad, my brother, was alive and he saw the things that has been done to the nation of Islam, listen, brother and sister, you would see more regular pets from where he done wore shoes at kicking them at. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, because of the work that has been going on in the nation of Islam. What was done to his temples. Come on. Come on, Supreme. Look, the sun, moon, and star put on the shoulders of your brother. Yes, sir. Right. Your husband. Yes, sir. Put a star in the center of the sister's hat. Right? That's right. That's right. That one dad, that something dad, the mold is. And, and I want to put one on you, too. Yes, sir. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. Go ahead, teach me. I want to put you in a uniform like these. Yes, sir. That's right. No. Well, I don't care what. Where you belong, I don't care what organization you be in. I don't care what church you belong to and where you're going. Let us get in our own nation of people and stay right. out of the devil's way. That's right. That's right. That's, yes, sir. That's, right. That's what I want. W.D. took from the brother's head off. That's right. That's what he did. Tore it away. Rod didn't know what he was doing. He said. He was a trickster. Mm -hmm. And he tricked it my father. Caused him to believe in the junk that he was teaching. I'm talking about my nephew. Yes, sir. I ain't talking about your people. Remember, I'm talking about my brother's son. Yes, sir. Don't get angry with me now because I'm talking about my brother's son. Of course, I have been cursed out because I said it. That's all right. All right, if you cuss me out, just don't hit me. That's right. That's right. I don't do that. No, because the Master Farad and the messenger taught me, he says, when somebody, don't you, when somebody hits you on this side, don't you turn another cheek like the Christian say? Mm. Come on. He hits you on one side, you knock the hell out of him on the other side. Right. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. You might can whoop me now, but I got eight sons. They're not here, but don't hit me. That's right. I'm still the daddy. That's right. Blood's thicker than water, regardless to or what. Now, if mention Elijah Muhammad was dead, was alive, and seeing all of this, 
and then go to Chicago and see the name change there from the temple there, Muhammad's temple to Mariam temple. Come on, Supreme. How do you, what do you think he would do? Come on, Supreme. Think about it. I don't hate Minister Farrakhan because he named the temple after his mother and took down Muhammad. I don't hate him for that. That was his mother. But I say to you, when you change the covenant of God, you're standing in a bad shape. That's right. That's right. Do you know how, how the name Muhammad's temple come about? Everybody know, hold up their head. How the name Muhammad's temple come about? Hold up your hand if you know. Come on. I hold up my hand. I know. Yes, sir. I know the difference in it. He taught it to me before he put the name Muhammad on a temple. The first temple that we ever had, what we call it, the Temple of Islam. That's right. The first one. When the birth of Islam was at 348 Hastings Street, it was birthed there in the year of 1933, yes, from 1931 to 3, it was birthed, the nation of Islam. We left the Woodman's Hall. And we had a few meetings at the UNIA Hall. But our brother Gava had in Detroit. Some say Elijah Muhammad was a member of brother Gava's organization. I don't know. But they went too far with the thing. They say he was a captain for Marcus Gava. He went to New York and Chicago with Marcus Gava. Now, brothers and sisters, you're wrong. That's right. Now you're wrong. That's what you have to wake up to. And the people don't like for me to tell the truth on people. That's right. That's right. That's the problem. That's, no, they don't. That's right. That's right. But I say to you, I'm going to tell you one truth. And I don't give a damn if you believe it or do it. When I visited him the last time in Chicago, and he was uh, at home, when he went back to the hospital, there he passed away in death. Now I can say, Mr. Minister Firecon, I know you was thinking. That is one of the causes That is one of the causes between me and Minister Farrakhan. People have asked me a lot of times. That's one of the causes. Yes, sir. He and Brother Jabril Muhammad and Phoenix say he is alive, living. Right. I say no. He is dead. Right, right. I have nothing against Minister Farrakhan, even if he do say that he's alive. I ain't got nothing to hate him for. 
what I'm going to hate him for. That's his knowledge. Right? My knowledge is he dead. And nobody yet has attacked me but one man, and that was Jabril. You know him, Jabril Muhammad in Phoenix. That's the only man attacked me with about 35 questions, and I answered a few of them and forgot the rest. That's right. Now let me show you something, brothers and sisters. You might believe that he's still alive. Let me show you something. Go ahead, teach me. Remember, that's my brother, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And he got a son named W.D. Muhammad, right? That's right. And W.D. Muhammad told Tony, what? Tony Brown, I think that's his name, everything that he thought he could say against his dad. That's right. I have a book on it. That's you right. probably seen it. Right? That's right? That's right. You might believe in WD. I ain't got nothing to do with WD. I don't hate him. What I hate is the two things that they are doing. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. That's what yes, I hate. Right. right. I said, Prophet Silas Muhammad, and he said, no, 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 no don't say that. I said, I'll call you about what you said you are. That's it. So now it's just, I'm Silas, Muhammad. That's right. Don't make no difference to me. If he say he's a prophet, you can say you's a prophet. Don't make no difference to me. No. Allah reveals to whom he please, right? That's right. All right. But he leaves out a whole lot of these people. <laughs> Go ahead, Supreme. You have to excuse me again. You know, you. Uh, I want to tell you something. You tired? No, no. I haven't got started. <laughs> don't get tired with me. I don't get tired with you. The better, the more I talk to you, the better I feel. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Yeah. That's the way I am. <laughs> Well, I better get on my subject. But here is what. Let me stop and get, get, on, get on with this part that I came to try to talk to you about. So that you would have some knowledge of these things. But I'm giving you good knowledge as it is. Yes, sir. That's right. Now, don't you know as I was going to say, if Messenger Elijah Muhammad, my brother, was alive, and he saw the things that has been done to the nation of Islam, listen, brother and sisters, you would see more regular pets from where he done wore shoes at kicking them at. You understand what I'm saying? Because of the work that has been going on in the nation of Islam, what was done to his temples. Come on. Come on, Look, the sun, moon, and star. Put on the shoulders of your brother. Yes, sir. Right. Your husband. Yes, sir. Put a star in the center of the sister's hat. Right? That's right. right. That one there, that something there, the mode is. And, and I want to put one on you. But here is what. Let me stop and get, get, on, get on with this part that I came to try to talk to you about. So that you would have some knowledge of these things, but I'm giving you good knowledge as it is. Yes, sir, that's right. That's right. 
Now, don't you know as I was going to say, if Messenger Elijah Muhammad, my brother, was alive, and he saw the things that has been done to the nation of Islam. Listen. Brother and sister, you would see more regular pets from where he done wore shoes at kicking them at. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Because of the work that has been going on in the nation of Islam. What was done to his temples. Come on. Come on, Sabrina. Look, the sun, moon, and star put on the shoulders of your brother. Yes, sir. Right. Your husband. Yes, sir. Put a star in the center of the sister's hat. Right? That's, that's right. right. That one there, that's something there, and the mold is. And I want to put one on you too. Yes, sir. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. Go ahead, teach me. I want to put you in a uniform like these. Yes, sir. That's right. Oh, well, I don't care where, where you belong. I don't care what organization you be in. I don't care what church you belong to and where you're going. Let us get in our own nation of people and stay right. out of the devil's way. That's right. That's right. That's, yes, sir. That's, That's right. what I want. WD took from the brother's head off. That's right. That's what he did. Throw it away. Rod didn't know what he was doing. He said. He was a trickster. Mm -hmm. And he tricked my father. Caused him to believe in the junk that he was teaching. I'm talking about my nephew. Yes, sir. I ain't talking about your people. I have nothing against Minister Farrakhan, even if he do say that he's alive. I ain't got nothing to hate him for. That's what I'm going to hate him for. That's his knowledge. Right? right? My knowledge is he dead. Right. And nobody yet has attacked me but one man, and that was Jabril. Right. You know him, Jabril Muhammad in Phoenix. That's the oldest man attacked me with about 35 questions, and I answered a few of them and forgot the rest. Now let me show you something, brothers and sisters. You might believe that he's still alive. Let me show you something. Go ahead, teach me. Remember, that's my brother, right? Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. And he got a son named W.D. Muhammad, right? That's right. And W.D. Muhammad told Tony, what? Tony Brown, right. I think that's his name, that's right. everything that he thought he could say against his daddy. That's right. I have a book on it. That's you right. probably seen it. Right? That's right? That's right. You might believe in WD. I ain't got nothing to do with WD. I don't hate him. What I hate is the two things that they are doing. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. That's what yes, I hate. That's right. I love the man. Both of them, my nephew and Minister Farrakhan, I love all of them. Yes, sir. Even to uh, Minister Silas, who was never in a minister's class. He has visited me here in Detroit. That's right. He honors me as Supreme Minister. That's right. He does. I honored him as prophet when I first met him in California. And 
Los Angeles. Me and your husband were there. You was there, wasn't you? Right. I said, Prophet Silas Muhammad, and he said, no, 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 don't say that. I said, I'll call you by what you said you are. That's it. So now it's just, I'm Silas Muhammad. That's right. Don't make no difference to me. If he say he's a prophet, you can say you's a prophet.